The National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Persons has tasked states and local government councils to live up to their responsibility and join the war against human trafficking. Director General of the agency, Julia Oka Donli, spoke to newsmen in Abuja, saying there is much expected from the government at the lower tiers of governance. Mrs. Oka Donley says traffickers are targeting Nigerians at the grassroots, so states and local governments must devise ways and means to educate the public on strategies being used by traffickers to lure unsuspecting victims. Human trafficking is a clear and present danger which confronts all nations in the world, either as a source, transit or destination country. It is therefore pertinent that the efforts to combat it should be wholesome and all-encompassing as well. The federal government of Nigeria is very concerned about the youth and takes any issue that affects them very seriously. We have demonstrated clear willingness to tackle this menace head-on and have come up with several empowerment schemes to, ex to engage the youth. I wish to congratulate NACTIP specifically for their efforts to re restore Nigeria to Tier 2 on the United States of America Trafficking in Persons report. We urge them to continue in their strides, and on our part, we will continue to give them the requisite support to succeed and even do more. When we say, call your government to action, the first thing a lot of people think about is the federal government. But we are trying to tell everyone that it's not just about the federal government. We have the state government, we have the local government. The federal government has already taken a huge step by establishing a national agency for the prohibition of trafficking in persons. One of the only such in the whole of the world that has a sole mandate of fighting human trafficking. So the state governments, I also expected to join us, and the local governments as well, I expected to join the federal government in this fight. And that is what some of them are doing. But we hope that all of them would join us. You know, the best policy the government should strive to do is to create a peaceful environment in the nation. The greatest cause of human trafficking is political instability and wars. Every other thing chickens in comparison to it. So any government that doesn't want its citizen to be trafficked, they must create policies that must create a peaceful environment. You can imagine if you go to Northeast now, you have millions of people being displaced. I mean, prostitution and all those vices become natural. You don't even need to force because people will be desperate. People will be, they will be fighting for survival. So the first policy is that they must engage in policy that will eliminate wars and grant political stability.